Hey there, NJRoot22.com here with our weekly supermarket uh, roundup vlog. I'm gonna get quick here because King's is, has some silly like Italian thing. I guess this week since there's no holiday, they're just doing a, an Italian promotion. There it is, Taste of Italy. I don't know what it means. IGA Bishops of White House, uh, we shop there because they're local. Uh, but they do have a good deal this week on uh, cantaloupes. Uh, better than ShopRite has them for three for five bucks. They're 99 cents a pop. So if you like cantaloupes, sweet, juicy, California-grown cantaloupes are 99 cents a pop. That's that's the highlight of the week. And something interesting. Let me get rid of my flyer. The uh, the ShopRite flyers you get in the mail or in your paper, or whatever, have coupons on them, and you can see it. It's like. Circular number 497, it says here. See that? 497. Uh, the ones they give you in the store do not have the coupons because they obviously don't want people taking them and stacking them and trading them with their friends and so on. Uh, and you can see there's a 497S there. And look, the bad thing on my finger went away finally. I busted my finger uh, many months ago and it, I had a big bruise and it's gone forever. So now my uh, identifying mark has been uh, eliminated. But anyway, real quick here, I mean, I, I don't know why I do this every week because you, know, you save a couple bucks here and there. The real savings comes for those people who do the couponing and they, they, they have coupon clubs and they get the Sunday paper for a dollar or whatever it costs these days. And they double coupon this and that and it, they spend probably like 10, 20 hours to save you know, an extra $20. Whatever, it's a fun thing to do. But I'm gonna talk real quick about uh, chicken. See, they have a sale this week. It's 88 cents uh, for chicken thighs, which is a really good sale. I and mean, I'm not sure who makes it, if it's just a store brand or Purdue. The thing is, I don't understand why everybody doesn't buy the skin on, bone in chicken. Because if you go look here, here's this crappy Tyson brand. The Tyson brand, um, when it's skinless, it's like more than twice as much per pound. I mean, why don't you just take the skin off? It's, it's, it, the, the chicken isn't made 50% of skin, so you maybe 10% of the weight is, is skin. You're just better off just cooking it, and it adds more flavor to the, to the chicken. Than when, I don't know. I don't know why people do it. Same thing with boneless. Boneless, the, the deboning process is so expensive, and I think it adds fluoride to the meat. You probably just want to have the bone and just eat around it. I mean, is it that difficult to, to navigate a bone these days? I mean, shoot, cavemen just used to eat the animal right then and there. Like, they didn't have all this complicated, fancifying process to, uh, to make it easier to eat. Jeez, I mean, what next? Is someone just going to feed you? Who knows? Anyway. I think that's, oh, I, I just wanted to let you know, I tried the, the ShopRite suit, and this isn't the ad for it, but they had this new uh, fried chicken. It was all right. I mean, I guess it tasted a little bit better, but I think it, the chicken seemed to be a little bit less substantial. I don't know. They did something, but the taste is good. The taste is very good. Um, they got the Biazzo Mutz again on sale for $1.99. It's a good thing to have. Same thing with the Jimmy Dean uh, bacon, which is, it works out to about $3.99 a pound. And here's something for people, I mean, I don't care if you have a family and you're trying to make ends meet, these Encore products, they're the worst. It's worse than cafeteria food. It has, it's loaded with preservatives and artificial ingredients, and it's just fake. It's fake food. Don't, don't, don't do it. Figure out a better way. Again, we X out all the junk. I mean, it's such junk, most of the packaged food, and I hate to be so strong-minded about it, but it's the truth. Um, what else do we have here? Oh yeah, the best organic eggs that ShopRite sells are the Pete and Jerry, Pete and Jerry's organic eggs. They're, they were rated the highest by the Cornucopia Institute. I mean, out of what ShopRite sells. I mean, I still buy them locally. If you find a farm or some somebody that raises chickens in their backyard, you're better off doing that. Seriously. And we have a sick dog, so they like the uh, the organic pumpkin. That that uh, makes uh, life easier for their stomach and their poop. And I think that's all I have this week. It's a quick, uh, I'll do my typical uh, PSA here. I mean, the, uh, the Nature's Bounty vitamins, they're okay. We've had good experience with them. Say no to the flu, sh flu shot, please. Just don't inject yourself with those chemicals. 
You're better off just like having your own body's immune system to figure out how to, to fight these things. And that's it. Like I said, Bishop's has the cantaloupes for a lot less than, uh, than ShopRite this week. And that's all. Have a nice weekend.